uh, that directional attack on the greatsword just kills me. So, we're gonna have three enemies down here. So let's spawn them. Kill one. Kinda go up the stairs. it off. So, back to the chest before I was so rudely interrupted. We get a majestic greatsword. What icon looks the most majestic? There we go. Oh, look at those stat requirements. 25, 25, 20, 20. 241 base. An ancient greatsword of unknown origin. The sword was passed down through generations until it reached Gordon, wandering knight of Ferosa, and was lost upon his death. Uncannily, every last one of the prominent swordsmen who inherited this weapon was left-handed. Interesting. I wonder if that means you're supposed to equip it in your left hand for something. Uh, let's find out. Ooh, that's a cool attack. Uh, there we go. Could be that you need the stat requirements for it. But I'm guessing it has some kind of special attack if it's in your left hand. Yeah, oh, now wait a minute. Well, I guess I came all the way down here for the sword, because I did have another way to go back up there. Unfortunately, it's crawling with enemies right now. <laughs> Because I didn't kill any of the ones on the way here. So, we're going to have to fight our way back through them. I feel like a weapon that has stat requirements like that has to be really good. If you if you boost all your stats. Maybe I will, um... Maybe I'll, like, respect my character at some point and see what kind of damage it does. way I did not go before. There was a fog door here, and then it puts me into this big room. So I'm nearing the bottom of this got the... Oh. I need to operate the lifts. Oh, bonfire. Get all our S 
just a smack. I'm surprised they gave me a bonfire. I figured it, the next thing I did was going to be to unlock like the, the shortcut back to the bonfire I was at before. Need a scorching or a scorched iron scepter. Good heavens. Some mages at the end of a hallway. And some boom guys. Those spikes make me nervous. Charging in recklessly, not the best idea. Is there a barrel down there? Ow. Oh jeez, I didn't see you. You go over there. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing happens. Okay, so we've got two mages down there. don't seem to care at all about my alluring skulls. Didn't I have, like, fire bombs on here? Aim is terrible. I really don't want to fight both of them at once. Guess I could just do this until one of them dies. Slow, but it'll work. There we go. Oh. 
Hi. How's it going? Fancy meeting you here. Oh god, no, not into the spikes. No, 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 no. Whew. Okay, hopefully this opens a shortcut. Yes. Oh, wait a minute. What is all this? Two ways to go. Is that? I don't think I was in that room before. Which of these is progress? That is progress because there's a fog door there. So many ways to go. Oh, I remember this place. Aha! Here's a shortcut. This is a shortcut back to... Is this the first bonfire? No, the second bonfire. Okay. I didn't even realize the whole wall could move. Fancy castle. Um, there is no way to progress that way, right? Yep. Yeah. Okay. So that's a shortcut. So what's all this about? the other side of this. More to the other side of this. Wait, what is this? Why is there like a metal... <laughs> that would have been handy. That opens that gate. But not that one. Can I go around here? This is where I entered from. Okay. So, that takes care of everything except this route. See what we 
we've gotten here. a room that I'm going to jump into later. That is maybe a torch. That is half of a... Is it just half of a person? Yeah. Their lower half is, like, burned off. Alright, let me see if I can light this. Yep. Okay, so these are the torches. Oh, he's alive. The jump attack seems very effective against these ones. Since you've got time to roll away. Petrified dragon bone. Quick sword Rachel. be invading me from. There. Okay, sword and shield. Quite a bit of damage. fire with you. It <laughs> should have been quicker sword Rachel is dead. Huh. How do I get off at this level? Jump from up here, I guess. Yeah. Gotta be a secret door. I didn't do that for a dried root, surely. I did. That's strange that there are three torches here. These are some dangerous torches, too. Like, I assume if I walk up to that, I'm gonna get burned. go counterclockwise.
recollection and twinkling. A hex created by the children of dark. Fire multiple dark orbs that seek their target. Hexes that grant a fleeting volition to dark have existed from ancient times, and it appears that the children of dark have some recollection of the creator of these spells. same room. Yes, so those two doors are connected. So did I happen to leave the progress door for last? I guess I did. Oh god! I don't know what that was, but it blew up. And it took the other thing with it. ones that are on fire explode. Large door, some piping, oh, big fire behind here, I saw it through the crack. Yep. Oh, they move fast. Blow up. Blow up. Blow up. like they were kind of like worshipping the fire almost the way they were arranged in here ah, I just got the scepter nice they seem to have extinguished their fire so the scorching iron scepter was like powering this thing it looks like I guess I'll go power the other one to see in here. I could use a torch. But then every time I two-handed my weapon, I would have to <laughs> relight my torch. Alright, this has got to take me back to a bonfire. Oh, hello there. Same symbol. Where is it gonna take me? This is where is this? Oh, this is the room I said I was gonna drop back into at some point. Right. 
So the bonfire from here was... Was it forward or backward? I think it was backward. Um... Yeah. There's a ledge I haven't been on yet. Look at all that loot. This was a shortcut back to a bonfire. And this was... a pretty long route, so I think I want to go this way. I don't remember exactly where that contraption was that I needed the scepter. Oh yeah, I do. It was in that it was in that big cylindrical pit. It's like toward the bottom of it. So here's my bonfire. Let's get my Estus back. And here is a pit. And here is where I need the scepter. Can I open this yet? No. Magic! So that lights this. And now all the lifts work. Now are you unlocked? No. I guess I need a key. Whoa! I think that's a statue and not an enemy. I hope that's a statue and not an enemy. Okay. So we've got two lifts, one of which I can take down. And I'll bet this other one takes me up to the start. Let's find out if that's true or not. But this takes me all the way up to the very top of the tower. Uh, where am I? Okay, this is where I encountered that the first barrel guys with the yep, the big guy there. Alright. So I have been here. Gosh, there's another set of elevators here. So does this one take me all the way up to the very beginning? Oh. Oh no. <laughs> I don't think I don't think I can make that jump. There we go. That's gotta be a shortcut somewhere. Uh, okay. I think I've been there before. Wait, 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 wait! Treasure! Treasure! Something I haven't picked up. Where was it? Right there. Spell Quartz plus three, so magic defense. Any other treasures? where I yeah this was where I first came into this area from so I need to take that lift down I think and get a key and then unlock all these doors I think I think 
think. Oh my, that does keep going down, doesn't it? Not into the fire. Out the door. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. dead. <sighs> I am going to take a break. <laughs> That's quite enough death for now. Definitely time for a break. So let's, I'll make a trip back to Majula and then I'll cut this video. So for those of you who wanted to see my stats, uh, here they are. Level 215, Vigor, Vite, and Strength build at the moment, but I'm thinking about switching it up to try that sword that scales on like four different things. And I'm using the Great Sword, the Dragon Rider Bow 5, Target Shield and Dranglaic Shield, and then the Bone King Armor, plus the Critical Hit Gauntlets. Got Ring of Blades 2, Third Dragon Ring, Life Protect, and this one I kind of switch out. Silver Serpent is sort of my go-to. Um, sorry, have we met? Oh, sorry. It's just I've been awfully busy lately. Care to look over my wares? Please, be my guest. I upgraded my stock recently, although it may be a bit out of your reach. <laughs> so Malin has, like, made the transformation fully from, like, you know, a, a just starting out salesman who's super appreciative of all the help that you give him. And now, like, his business is booming and he doesn't even remember who you are. Whoa, wait, what is this? There's all sorts of new stuff here. Hang on. Alright, we've got the Throne Watcher stuff, we've got the Throne Defender stuff. Velstat's armor. Looking Glass armor. Smelter. But what is this up here? Moon Butterfly Skirt. A skirt made from wings of the rare Moon Butterfly poisons those who approach its wearer. Also extends jump distance. Whoa. Little is known about the moon butterfly, which only appears on a full moon on full moon nights in winter. Some say the butterfly is a magical being, and its larvae have never once been spotted. Totally buying that. Guess there's no hat. Alva armor? Hold on, there is so much stuff here. Also extends jump distance. Poisons nearby foes and increases length of jump. What is this Alva armor? Let's buy that too.
probably buy some of these things too later when they get more souls. Thanks for the purchase. All right, so let's see what this stuff looks like. We've got Alva's armor. I like it. It definitely goes with the Dranglaic shield. Kind of matches. Just that insignia. Huh. It's like a leaf, maybe? And then... What are these? Whoa! <laughs> oh my god! Wow! I wonder how many things this lets you jump onto. Let me go up to my jumping rock over here. Uh, wait, which one is the jumping rock? This one. No. I know there's a rock here I can climb up onto. There we go. Let's see if I can actually make the jump up onto this thing. No, it still doesn't let me jump any higher. You've been long away. What would you like? What? Whoa. Is that the armor? It says it damages foes, but I guess it damages NPCs too. I probably don't want to kill the Emerald Herald. Well, I'll be getting more souls and playing more fashion souls. <laughs> Alright, so that'll do it for today. Uh, thank you, everyone who's watching. Uh, feel free to leave a comment, talk about whatever you want, and I will see you, hopefully, pretty soon.